Uh, thank you. Local water districts are trying to do more during good water years to recharge our underground water supply here along the Wasatch Front. That's why a new aquifer storage and recovery well is being placed at the Little Cottonwood Water Treatment Plant. ABC 4's Nate Larson live at that well with more on this project. Nate. Yeah, Glenn. So, yeah, here at the uh, Little Cottonwood Water Treatment Plant, there's a uh, big drill behind me. You can see kind of the canvas as well. That's a sound barrier to help some of the residents. So Metropolitan Water District uh, for Salt Lake and Sandy is working to install this 700 foot well that's going to help essentially recharge the aquifer below. The water district is currently involved in a managed aquifer recharge project designated to improve the reliability, resiliency, and sustainability of the water supply in Salt Lake County. In May, we started drilling with the ASR, and it's a injection well. What we're trying to do is when there's available water in a year like this where we have plenty of snowpack and the demand is low, that we can take that excess water and inject it into the ground and really to revitalize our aquifer. The Little Cottonwood Water Treatment Plant provides drinking water to Salt Lake and Sandy Cities. And after years of a study from a test well on site, they found out they're in a prime location for aquifer recharge. Currently, we're drilling uh, one ASR well. We we'll also will have two infiltration basins, as well as monitoring wells where we can measure the level of the water in the aquifer. The project will hopefully be completed by midsummer and will be ready for use next runoff season. I've got a blind dog who's a little frightened by the noise, but other than that, no, it hasn't been a, a particular inconvenience. And they have done a nice job of keeping us informed. We get mailings from them and uh, yeah, they've done a nice job. The injection well is no easy task. The drill operates night and day and will continue to run for the next several months. Well, I think it makes uh, a ton of sense what they're doing. They're improving the efficiency of water storage, which improves delivery. And uh, I think in, in our part of the world, anything they can do to make that better is, is well appreciated. The injection well taps directly into the aquifer and will be replenished with treated drinking water. The water district estimates that in good runoff years, they'll be able to inject up to 29 acre feet per day. The recovery is going to take time. It's not as fast as we had a great snowpack and our aquifer is going to recover. So this is a way that we can manage um, really having a healthy and sustainable water supply for the Salt Lake Valley. All right, so the drilling behind me, I'm told, is down to about 250 feet right now. That's of 700, so they still have a ways to go. You can find project updates uh, on the Water District's website. We'll have a link to that under this story on abc4.com. Live at the Little Cottonwood Water Treatment Plant, I'm Nate Larson. Back to you.